please welcome supermodel and author, Lyris Cross, and style expert and author, George Brescia. Hi. Oh, oh my God. God. You look beautiful. You look beautiful. Oh, thank you. We are Oscars ready. So, yeah. whoo. Okay, so it was so many amazing fashions. I didn't get to get to it. They were on the red carpet. <laughs> Let's get started with the Queen Angela Bassett. Oh, Queen Mother served vibranium realness because she gave us life. Yes. Okay. <laughs> She looked amazing in this Jeremy Scott from Moschino dress. The purple gave you regal, it gave you queen. Yes. She literally floated. She floated. She really did. I mean, this is how to do it. The Angela knows what's going on. I mean, come on, the silk chiffon, the Bulgari snake around the yes. neck, darling. Yes, honey. <laughs> She's just letting you have it in every single way possible. The hair, the makeup, impeccable. Yes. I thought she looked so amazing. I just was like, my breath was taken away. Yes. So, okay, so now we have Angela. We, Lady Gaga came and rocked the red carpet. Mm -hmm. What did you think of Lady Gaga's look? Lady in the front party. Gorgeous. But listen, you all, there was a party in the back because there was a drop waist in the back and it was sexy. sexy. Very sexy. You know, simple is hard to do and yes. she really pared it down. This is a Versace gown that she got in LA because she Ooh. saw they did a show and she took it from Gigi Hadid mm -hmm. and she put her spin on it. And then those Tiffany jewels, darling, yes, from the 1950s archives yes. that they got from Tiffany's. And she just is shining and gorgeous. That red lip, that smoky eye, fierce. Yes. That, that simple, that Very. simple French braid. I thought it was very, like, very old Hollywood. Yes. I love this look on Lady Gaga. I wish she would have kept it on through when she was singing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, but I love this look. Now, Rihanna and the baby bump walk the red carpet. So lyrics. Yes. What do you think about that? Well, Rihanna shows us that style has no body shape, no size, no age. She yes. showed up as the fashion god that she is. Mm. She was wearing Alaya, and Alaya is known for sexy clothes for women that skim the body, and she mm. did that. She really did. I mean, so gorgeous. This is brown leather. Oh, it's, I love that it was brown leather. Brown yes. leather with the yes. cutouts, and then she had on this gorgeous sheer turtleneck in black. So she's mixing the black and brown. It looks so gorgeous. That little spiked on top of the hair with that bun, and that red lip, and that smoky yes. eye, and a little drop earring. Now she knows what she's doing. Okay, I feel like it, you, Rihanna was amazing, but this is the hardest working baby in Hollywood. This baby, yes. she got this baby working. Yes. yes. All right, so next is uh, actress Cara Delevingne. She, how does she do, George? Oh, Woo! my God. Oh, my God. I mean, absolutely gorgeous. She was definitely one of my favorites of the night. This is Ellie Saab. Now, this is how a young starlet should look. So gorgeous, Ooh. really looking like the Oscars. That thigh-high slit. I yes. mean, come on, legs for days. She's giving you those beautiful jewels, that slicked back hair. I'm like, she's getting me a little confused. Yes. I don't know what to do. I mean, you know, I like men, but I mean, hello. <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> that may change you, yes. huh? All right, what'd you the think, Liz? The red, the red, the red. First of all, she gave us old Hollywood glamour. She gave me Grace Kelly vibes. Yes. And, but she put her modern feel to it. Yes. And that's what I really, really loved about it. And that split, yes. yes. Okay, Lyris, you gotta tell me, because you are a supermodel. We've seen you hit that runway. Thank you. Every time I got a slit, I don't know what to do with my leg. I'll be like this. <laughs> How do you do a slit? How do you do a good slit with, you with just, your leg? What do you do with your leg? It's kind of like you put one leg out and you just kind of lean back. Oh, and you lean back. Oh. Lean back. Oh, like, lean like back. Fat Joe says, lean back. Oh. But don't lean all the way back. Just but leaning lean back, back will show back. it. Lean oh, so you don't back. do this? Okay. <laughs> no. no. Okay, I got you, girl. Oh, my okay. God. All right, so <laughs> thank you, Liz. See, that's why you got to ask a supermodel to show you. Thank you. Everybody was talking about actress Florence Pugh. Please tell me about this, Liris. Okay. I, mm, I mean, you go ahead. You go first, my No, love. you go, you go. All right, oh, well, George. I'm going to tell you it wasn't my favorite. No. Because, you know, this is Valentino, and the best thing about this was the Tiffany, you know, chevron necklace that was so gorgeous, but this Valentino, honey, I'm just gonna tell you, it looks like she took the comforter off her bed and wrapped yeah, herself exactly. around it. I mean, it I did does. not love it. No, no, no. What'd you say? Well, I do feel like Florence is a it girl right now, right. and she's daring. She doesn't really care about what any of us think. It looks she's like she's gonna go out there. It, yeah. But you know what? Valentino does really great color. I really wish it was like that pink that she wore right. this past summer to the show that her nips were out. Uh -huh. And um, 
And if it was that color, it would have gave a certain pop. But I did love the shorts. I thought it was fun and modern. Well, you can tell the shorts. It looks like it's a spank. And it looks like if I she know. got tired, she could roll it up and put it on as a pillow. Yes. Definitely yes. not my right. favorite. Right. George, this one not this wouldn't no, not our favorite. No, so no. y'all. Now the men also they they cut out. They showed out on the red carpet. Mm -hmm. George, who was your favorite? Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Yes. <laughs> Muscle man in pink, Dolce Cabana with the flower. You know, I have a flower too. I mean, let me tell you, this man knows how to do it. That's a hot looking man. Okay, that looks good. Now, Lyris, who was your favorite man? Harry Shum Jr. Oh, you like Harry I, Shum? Yes. I like this look. Yes. I thought it, he was different. He, he kind of had this East yeah. meets West. Yeah. The navy blue with the tie at the waist was a nod to his culture. I really loved that. And he just, he's done. Okay, my favorite one was, I'm sorry, my favorite one was, uh, 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 who, who's a Zoe? Lenny, Lenny Kravitz. Ooh, come Lenny on now. Lenny Kravitz, because Lenny Kravitz, no matter what he wears, he looks, uh, Lenny Kravitz. Gorgeous. Literally. He was gorgeous. gorgeous. No matter what Lenny Kravitz wears, he always looks like he wants to have sex with you. I mean, and even at the Oscars, hi, Lenny. he looks like he wants to have sex. <laughs> He looks so handsome. Oh my gosh, George and Lyris, yes. thank you so much thank for you. being thank here. Y'all, for more info on Lyris and George, go to SherryShowTV.com.